Hi guys and welcome to another November video. In today's video I want to share my natural cleaning products with you. So sit tight, get your coffee and enjoy! The ingredients in commercial cleaning products can be toxic and these chemicals can be hard to handle and um, difficult to dispose. They can also irritate your eyes, your skin and your respiratory systems. These natural cleaning products have the same effect as chemicals but they are natural. I am going to show you some of my cleaning products that I am using to clean my home. They will also save you money and as I already said they are as effective as commercial products. The first thing is obviously white vinegar or apple cider vinegar. I buy um, white vinegar at the supermarket. It's really really cheap alternative. My apple cider vinegar I also buy in a bottle. Um, it's glass so I can good reuse it again. White vinegar and apple cider vinegar are such amazing cleaners and you can use them to clean almost everything. I will also share my all purpose cleaner recipe. I will put you link somewhere up here or maybe down in the description box. Um, so make sure you check it out. It's really simple and easy, but it cleans like this. <laughs> the next thing I have here is this little guy. Yeah. Yes, it's lemon. The lemons, due to their acidity, um, are great at killing bacteria, and they are also great at removing the odors from containers. I use them in the kitchen when I want to remove the odors from the other utensil that I am using in my kitchen. Next great helper is um, baking soda or natron. I buy my um, at the bulk store or I um, buy it online. Baking soda is very versatile. You can use it for baking, for cooking, as a deodorizer or as a cleaner obviously. What you can also do is to add um, a little bit of water to a baking soda and make a little paste and you can use it in the bathroom to clean all the spots that are on the bath or sink or you can use it to clean your toilet. Versatile product I love to use is um, Dr. Browner's Baby Mild um, Castle Soap. It's a vegetable based soap. As I said, it is a very versatile product. You can use it to wash your hands, wash your hair, wash your body, but you can also use it to clean all the surfaces in your household and a lot more. The last but not least thing I want to share with you guys are my essential oils and I love them. They are made of plant extract. Nowadays there is actually a big choice of scents of the essential oils, like you can find any scent that you like, from tea tree to lavender, lemon, lemongrass, uh, frankincense. Uh. What you can do with the essential oils, you can simply add them to your cleaning product to freshen up your home a little bit. I almost add them to everything. I just want to make sure guys that you, when you want to buy essential oils, um, you're gonna pick a sustainably minded brands because not all of them are producing their essential oils um, very sustainable. Essential oils are not very cheap. If you want, if you see a cheap essential oil, it's probably not 100% organic, not 100% natural. Cheap essential oils are not very ethical, I guess. So make sure you, when you want to buy them, go for a higher price and be sure that you 
by sustainably minded brands. If you decide to clean your homes, make sure that you use utensil made of wood, wooden natural scrubbers or plant-based sponges and you can reuse your old t-shirt or old towels to clean up. Let me know if you have any other suggestions for me or a great recipes that you like and that are helpful and you try them and you use them. Check me on the Instagram, put the hashtag of November everywhere so I can see how you guys are reducing your waste and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because the next video is coming tomorrow so bye! Thank mm -hmm. you.